Kristen, I didn't even realize that you didn't have your ears pierced. Nope, I have not had pierced ears in over a decade. Don't tense up, trust me, it's easy. I love to be tense. I'm holding your hand in spirit, remember. Okay, cool. I'm actually like a little overwhelmed now, to be honest. All right, young lady, deep breath in and breathe out. It's Ladyleg and I'm getting my ears pierced. I first got double holes when I was in middle school, I wanna say. And I remember going to Claire's in the mall and like getting the gun to punch the holes. I remember being like, I know this was a reward, but it wasn't really a reward. I also develop scar tissue really easily. I get a lot of keloid scars as evidenced by this little bad boy right here. Me too. So like I heal up pretty fast, which means that if I wasn't careful, I was gonna get earrings in my ear. In fact, that happened once. I put a backing in my ear so far back it grew into my ear. I had to get it cut out. At what point did you realize that you just did not want your ears pierced anymore? I've never liked my face, but I didn't start strategizing about how to make it less apparent to others until probably middle school. That's when I was like, hmm, maybe there's a reason why boys don't like me. Perhaps it's my face. And so I was like, okay, new strategy. Instead of calling attention to my face, I hide my face. And in earrings just kind of felt like another thing that sort of drew attention between here and here. And then when I stopped wearing them, they grew back together. But there's so many cute earrings. Yeah, I know, that's the problem. And I think they're cute, but I still think it's like too much for my face. Why do you wanna give this earring thing another go? I see people wearing them and I'm like, oh my God, so adorable. Plus you can wear your hair up and you got a statement earring. The fact that I don't have pierced ears has come up a lot behind the scenes in videos. A few years ago, we did a styling thing where they structured a whole look around me having like slick back hair and, and like earrings and like I couldn't do it. When I did style swap with Jasmine, I don't have pierced ears, so that came up too. Basically anytime anyone tries to make me over, there's an issue about my not having pierced ears. What if I just took you and got your ears pierced today? Oh my God, like I got a nice report card in seventh grade. So I'm very excited, but I'm also, I really want you to start to learn to love your face. And I don't know if this is the first step, but that's the goal. I think it's a step. Serious question. What if I get in there and I'm a little whiny baby? It's okay, I'll hold your hand. But you have to shoot the video. It's okay, I'll hold your hand in spirit. You ready to go? <laughs> yeah, okay, let's go. My name is Roger. Everyone knows me as Roger Rabbit. I've been in the industry for about 20 plus years. I'm the owner and founder of Ancient Endowments Body Piercing here in West Hollywood. So we're gonna be piercing Kristen's ears today. The process will be pretty quick. The longest part is actually taking the jewelry out. Hi. Hey. Hi, I'm Kristen. Hi, Kristen, I'm Roger. Nice to meet you. So we're gonna be piercing my ears today. A couple things we need to find out first is, have your ears ever been pierced? Yes. I have previously had two holes in each ear. This like second hole up here closed when I was like 15. And the first hole closed when I was about 21. Well, there's a couple things that we look at and we have to assess. Are the holes still open? Can we just reopen them? Wait, they're not still open. Yeah, everybody thinks that, but a lot of times when you're trying to put earrings in, you're doing it blindly because you're just going by feel. So sometimes you're not even pushing the earrings straight back. I truly do not think they're open. Don't make me justify myself. Would you say that needles are better than guns? Well, it's not really making an incision. It's literally just slamming an earring through your ear, which obviously is not safe or clean. More needles, where disposable, super sharp, are designed to break the skin. Needles are just cleaner generally, the way they're currently used. A million used. times cleaner, and that's the tool that we use, just like you would go to a doctor and if you need an injection, they would use a needle too. Let's go look at some all jewelry. Right, let's take a look. We're looking at earrings now. Yeah. It's funny, I'm seeing the pretty parts and all I can think about right now is the, the other side, which will be going through my ear shortly. Yeah. <laughs> so wait, Kristen, I don't know this about you. Are you a gold person, a silver person, rose gold? When I was younger, I was told I could only wear silver. And then I was told that that was nonsense and that I could only wear gold. And now as an adult, I learned that's all nonsense and that I can wear everything. But I really love rose gold. It's a pretty color. I really like these bumblebees. I think they're really cute. Also, I'm afraid of bumblebees too. So maybe we can kill two birds with one stone. I really like these lightning bolts here. You know why I like bees? It's because they're too fat to fly, but they do anyway. Which one are we gonna pick We're gonna sure? do the bees. That's a good choice. Yeah. I love them. I like the color. So what I'm gonna do next now is I'm gonna grab the jewelry. We're gonna sterilize it in our autoclave. Auto. It only takes six minutes. So you should be out here in about 15 total. All right, well, let's stick some bees in my ears All then. All right, let's do it. We're in it, we're in the room. The chair's right there. This is do or die. I've been told we will not die, Fred. 
Well, what's gonna happen now? What we're gonna do is I'm gonna have you tie your hair up. You have to keep in mind, if I have earrings on, I have to do this. Like, no, that fucks with the symmetry of what I've created. This is a choice. Did you hear that? Pull your hair back? It's starting. It's starting. Yeah. I'm actually like a little overwhelmed now, to be honest. Cause this has been like my deal. Like this is how I hide. And so disrupting that is hard. You're gonna look beautiful. Okay. You can tell I'm nervous cause I've already kicked off my shoes. That's like my stress response to most things. So we're gonna do some very simple cleaning. And then from there, I'll take a look at your ear, make sure things are looking awesome. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna use a little thin toy here and I'm just trying to see if you have an existing hole that's still open or if it closed up all the way. I truly do not think they're open. Don't make me justify myself. Technically your hole is open. What? So the hole is open? Yeah, it's it's barely, barely just holding on. This is well, wild. Yeah. They don't feel open for the record. After that, just be a quick look at my mark. So I'm just gonna mark your old spot, okay? Okay. Did you wanna take a look in the mirror at the marks? Yeah, these look good. That's where my earrings are gonna go. Just breathe in your nose and hold it. And when I say relax, I'm breathing out a candle, breathe out your mouth, okay? In your nose, out your mouth. I'm holding your hand in spirit, remember. Okay, cool. That doesn't hurt, right? Nope. Don't tense up, trust me, it's easy. I love to be tense. All right, young lady. Deep breath in and breathe out. That's it, done. Wow, that was really easy. Yeah. <laughs> that was super easy. So you have a little bit of pressure here. Ooh. That's it. That's that nice. was actually worse than the going in. And then we're gonna put a little bumblebee and we're done. I mean, just clean around it and then we'll have you take a look. Oh, so cute. Look how pretty. All right, let's do the other one so I don't look like a pirate. Kristen, you're doing great. I know. You ready? I'm ready, I'm ready, let's do it. Deep breath. And breathe out. Get done. Oh, that was not bad. Are you excited to see the I other one? I am excited to see them. All right, let's go look at his friend. Look how cute they are. I got little holes in my ears. My ears are very red right now. They look a little embarrassed, but they're not, I promise. So how was it? It was really easy. I think the lead up to it is harder than the actual piercing. I'm telling you, you picking the jewelry is the worst part. Really? Picking the jewelry is the worst part? Because you have so many decisions, it takes forever. Might be the worst part for you. Honestly, it's much less painful than the gun. So would you recommend a piercing shot versus yes. a gun plate? Oh my God, it's so much easier than the gun, so much faster. A lot of people are gonna be looking in my general face area, especially like in like the central no-go zone, as I call it. I just coined that right now. I don't actually call it that. I feel like I have to actually wear things now, not actually just hide my ears with my hair. Getting my ears re-pierced for the first time in a decade. Lady tested. Lady whole again. Ah! 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 So many high fives. Yes. <laughs> high five sandwich. <laughs> Hey, Unsolved is on a new channel, and now your part. Subscribe, Subscribe here. here. That was my part.